we thank God for the breath of life. Amen. I greet you all around the world in Jesus' name. Amen. Yedan yamiasi wo enkwa home home. Amen. Yasi afananyina bichiamu wo Yesu dimu. Amen. Today is edition 103 of the ability to see. Yeah. The Abema or Timidia Huna de Yeno, and nay any far a tosso or ha any mesa. Let's hear the heavens report for today. Yentie and ne heaven a money bonum. God is the God of truth, and there is no iota of a lie in him. Therefore, Whoever claims to be a child of God but deals in lies mm-hmm. is not a child of God. Yeah. He is a child of Lucifer, mm-hmm. the father of all lies. Mm-hmm. If you want the protection of God, be truthful in all your ways. Yes. This is Pastor Dr. Kukudazi reporting live from heaven. Men. Nyame iye no kware nyame. Na enada kitikiti kra enene mo. Yeah. Anunti obiara onu ne sese oye nyankopon ba. Na otnasi wo na demu no onye nyankopon ba. Yeah. Oye bonsamo a oye atrufo ina eja no eba. Yeah. So pese onye nyankopon ba mbo dinu kware ewo wakwan yina emu mm-hmm. we your sofo dr kuku dazi mama ni ba be the free heaven amen i have been drawing your attention to spiritual security me chi wadwen asi sunsumu bambo ehu i want serious christians to be spiritually secure under the genuine servant of God. Amen. Mi pese e Christofo a wani abre no. Wa si tim sunsun mu e wo nyankopon akoa kan pa ase. You shouldn't play with your spiritual security at all. Yes. Memfa o sunsun mu bambo e ni agrokra. When demons strike and you are not under God's anointed servant, you will not be safe. Mm-hmm. Demons can have easy access into your life. Yeah. Say Adam oni kan won hu se wo di boni. Na won hye nyankopon akoa wasra ne ngo asia. Won fa won tototo nkodi. Yeah. Adam oni betumi anya kwan biara wo pe e di aba wa brabom. Yes. That is why you should be wise not to sit under a preacher who is not of God. Enunti ne sese uye nyanseni na wanko tina ensempakeni biara onfri nyame ase. Never be under any pastor whose utterances attract God's case. Men ko she osofu biara Nen sem kayano etu chin nyanko pon en no me banu asida. I don't know why you want to be a part of someone's case. Mintia se se weni beji hun se udi uhumbe kwako frafra ubi en no me mu. If you follow a preacher who is fake in God's eyes, you are not covered spiritually. Saudi in Sampakania, Yami and Nisun, on your papa a chia, Susun Mono, Uni in Katasobia. God gathers all his sheep under his chosen servant. Therefore, if even you are an innocent sheep and you lose your way to be among wolves, you can imagine what can happen to you. Yes. They will devour you mercilessly hmm. because 
you came among them. Yeah. Nyankupon eboa ni nyanya wa huni ya sembiara di she na kuwa wa yino asi. Enunti sempo uyo janya wa huni ya sembiara. Na ufum eko fra mpate kumwa. Wankasa genhu di ombe tibidia yo. Mwesemu. Mm -hmm. Ombe yu pasa pasa pasa. Esanze wabe fra umu. Mm -hmm. So it is your responsibility to make sure that a church is of God mm -hmm. before you join. Mm -hmm. Else you will be in a demonic group where there is no protection from God. Enunti a yewan kasa wa sudi se obe shese a sorry be free nyame and sana u do hun akodom. A nye sa u do hun be kwa akodom a damo ni kuwa nyankupon bambo biara enimu. It is only when you are at a place where God is then you can benefit from his protection. Se uko bebia nyankupon wong kwa e na ube nya ne bambo nsoso hon mfaso. But if you sit under a preacher whose utterances attract God's cares, the cares of the preacher will affect you. Ne mom, se uko tina nsempakenia ni nsem kayenu etu chen nyankupon no me ba enasia ni no me no Yes. And how can you know that a preacher is not of God? Ne be den wo hunu se en sempa kani bi en frinyame. It is his bad doctrine and arguments about the Bible. E ye ne chire chire boni ene ne chini jia o jifa Bible hon. The Bereans, Apostle Paul spoke about in the book of Acts, were fair-minded people mm -hmm. who received the word of God from Apostle Paul and searched the scriptures daily to find out if what they heard were so. Berea for noa, asma for Paul, kan wo huwa sem e wo asma for e ngomano e mono. Na we nipa wa jine mu dao pa a a sempa noa wa jifri o suma fo po honu wa kwa shi she nyankupon a se mu e she se en sempa noa wa ti ye no sa pe 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 en aneti ana If you don't care of whom you sit under as a church goer but take every preacher to be a servant of God because he uses the Bible to preach and cause his organization church, you will throw yourself to demons. Mm -hmm. Mm. It is because demons also have their surrogates to establish churches to confuse innocent people mm -hmm. about God's word. Mm -hmm. That is why you have to be careful of whom you follow if you don't want to be deceived. As it said, Adamo Nesuo, Womo Siyane Mufwa, Womo Atititite Nsoria, Odima niema bafre nipa wa huni asembiara afa nyankupo wa asemu. Enunti enesese uyashe iye pa ewo nipa ubetinaji. Sa humu pese yebe dadawa. When you find God's servant to place yourself under, you come under God's protection. Because God protects his obedient children, he places God. Under his chosen servant. So who nyankupon akwa kain pa now the hunko she nasia? Ube she nyankupon bambo asi. Esan se nyankupon bonema o ye osutia 
wadi won a she na ko awoyi no ase obai yeah when god put israel under his prophets he always protected them from their enemies mm-hmm. and none of them could defeat them yeah wa bra nyankopon edi israel no wa ye ne nkrofo no she edifo no ase no de biara na obo wo ho ban e free atamfo na o mu mu biara en to me en di won so similarly when the lord jesus placed the church under the apostles the holy spirit was with them and protected them from their enemies in all their ways sansu sunsu na eradi yesu christo e di asoru she asomafo no ase no na hun kronkron ka won hun na wo bo wo hun ban e wo won kwan nyina emu therefore if demons can do whatever they want with you in the house you call church it's obvious that god is not with you anunti sa damoni to me yo de wo pe biara wo fia wo fra no asori no emu a ani na de de se nyankopon enka ho it could be that the preacher is not of god and his church is a demonic playground e betumi abase en sempakani no on fri nyame na na sorry fi ho no e ye be bia adamoni diagro don't give yourself freely to demons by being in demonic churches men fa ho nche adamoni kwa wa bra wo kotna adamoni nsorebo you will always remain vulnerable and prone to demonic attacks until they finally kill you o be dam pain sa ama adamoni ntunhye so biara nso so aka o akosi se awiye no o mbeku it was knowing the importance of spiritual security that was why moses asked the lord to be with him and bring him to the promised land mm-hmm. and god also promised moses in exodus chapter 33 verse 14 that my presence will be with you and i will give you rest hallelujah amen eh sunsu mo bambo hia ehia na moses ni munti e no sra urade se on kan ho na on fa israel for enkodru bo she asase ne so e na yakopon so so she moses bo e wo moses wo ma to so mienu ti aduasa miensa ti chemu du nine no se menim ene wo beko na me ma wo asum dey hallelujah amen moses understood what it was for god to be with him He was spiritually secured when God was with him. Mm-hmm. That is all that you need as a human being. No Moses ti ase pa se nyame ka se oka ne ho a. Sunsun mono na na se tim. Sa ene die ni pa da sane bia ohia. Let God be with you in all your ways. And no demon can harm you. Manyankupon en kan ho e wo akwan nyina mu na adamon biara en to me en yo boni. If you don't realize this, you will be alone for demons to do what they want with you. So wan hunu we ya e be ka won kwan ama adamon aye wo de wo pe biara. Because Israel didn't realize this, that is why they offended God and God gave up on them for their enemies to terrorize them for 40 years all the time. Oh. Hmm. Isan say Israel en hunu we inti. En na wo fum nyame. Ema nyame epo wo mbra ema wo. 
ema wan atamfo eye won boni mu ohuna mane won fi aduanan emu no mm-hmm. but whenever Israel returned to the lord with all their hearts in fear god also protected them again from their enemies mm-hmm. nanso so abre biara israel sadu akuma eba nyame nchen e wosro mu bia no nyankopon so so e bo wo ho ban e firi wo atamfo mm-hmm. that was the situation of israel under the judges mm-hmm. sana na israel te bia no te e wo atemufo no abreso that situation is in the Bible to let today's church people see the importance of God's protection mm-hmm. and not do anything to let God go away from them. Sasem no ewo Bible mu se de be ya e be ma nei asorfo ahu nyankopon bambo hu hia hia pa na wa nye bibiara ama nyankopon am free won chen anko. Because you don't know when demons will strike, that is why you should always hide yourself under the shadow of the Almighty God. Esan se wunim abra adamoni ebe sorry wa usunti no ene se se de biara ude unko she unyami tumfo ninyono no aseno. That is the only safe place. Yeah. Demons are doing a lot of evil to people in this world. And the only safe heaven is the true church of the Lord Jesus Christ under his anointed servant. Mm-hmm. Yes. Eye Eradi Yesu Kristo asori kan ya e se na ko a wasra ne ngono ensa yeah one thing that lets God's people lose their protection is lies mm-hmm. adia bakwa e manya nkopon krofo e hwe won sunsun mu pambo e ya tro yes many preachers and church people don't have God's protection because they don't deal in truth. And some paka for p, any a sorry for p, any nyanko pon bambo, esanse when di no kware. Revelation chapter nineteen verse eleven states that the name of the Lord is faithful and true, and in righteousness he judges and makes war. Therefore, for the Lord to judge issues righteously for you and fight your battles, you should be truthful, yeah. just as He is. What you know, you want to do some tea, don't crown to Chemu Duba Konose, a radidini or no coffee, and it did not no quarry. Now, Trinimu and Obu attain na Otusa. I don't say all people are ready. A boo attain a war and never who a war train a human. Now, who comes to there? Any as I said, Oye no kafu said you or no Oye no kafu on the bed. Because today's church people are bent on dealing in lies. That is why God is not with them. It's an say nay a sort of kafu. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh and om de be om bibia ntino and am ma nyankopon so enka won no i say that if even the devil who is the father of all lies stops his lies today and decides that he will not continue to be the devil anymore still his lying attribute will send a lot of church people to hell yes me can say o bon sabo o ye atrufo nyina eja no so o ka se ne o jai na o nya dwuma bia o kra na tro suban no nko a e betumi de enipa bebre e gusuara akobon sabje 
It's because church people don't stop lying. Ningina and they say, I sorry for enjoy a trial. Lies are in the marrow of today's church people. A trial, I would not a sort of for a minimum. Many of them lie in everything they do. It's like truth is a taboo to them. One would do do one. A dear tro, a wa dear way in your ammo. Now, Becasse, no quality, a bosom, a mamma crow. I don't understand why some people profess to be the children of the truthful God, but deal in the lies of Satan, mm -hmm. who is God's enemy. Mm -hmm. I don't understand that. Mentias, yes, eh. E nipa binum ebe fre wa hon se wo ye nyame no kwa fu wa no ema. Na yon so so, wo ye wo nyema, e wo bonsam atro mo. Wo abra bonsam, e ye nyanko pontan fu. The lying spirit in them, doesn't let them see what they do at all. Atro hon hon mono eti wo mono, ema wo hon ye wo ye kwa. Many preachers are liars. And many church people are also liars. Hmm. You can't trust them. It's true. The preachers lie to the church members. And the church members also lie to the preachers. In some paka fopi, eya trofo. Na asolko fopi, susu, eya trofo. In some paka fono, edi atrochre asafumano. Ena safo manan soso, edi atrochre en sempaka fo. They are in competition of lying. Yes. Womu si atroho akain. As the old prophet lied to the young prophet in 1 Kings chapter 13, so are some prophets lying to their fellow prophets. Said ye, O di fwa kokrano, o di atrochre, o di fwa brantieno. E wo ahimfo ngume di kany ti du miyansano. Sana e di fwa bide misoso, e di atro, achre wa fe fwa e di fwa. En asadaneas and his wife Safira lied to Peter, so are today's church people lying in the presence of the Holy Spirit. Hmm. Na sedye, anania zine yiri safira ansoso, o di atro echre epita no. Sa neneyi asore fu ansoso, o di atro e o nyame un kron kron enim. They are not afraid to lie at all. On so se obe di atro kra. Ebi de, ebi de. One medium that helps to these people to lie is telephone. Mm-hmm. Na adia bakwa e bua ma nipa e wo wiase nei wo di atropa no e tetefo hmm. someone may be at one location but because of the telephone he will say he is at another location hmm. nipa bi betumi a obi abako nanso esa en tetefo enti obekan se obi afoforo hmm. Someone may be in Kumasi, but he will say he's in Accra. A bit to me, a basset will be a Kumasi, and so a bit can say, oh, I'm crying. A female student may be with her male boyfriend in his room, but will answer the phone and tell another student that she is in her own room. A bit to me, a basset, a discern me, baby. I want him pinna bear my den. Nancy, so Obe Cassa, I will take the phone so actually at this year, if for say or no one Cassa to them. A wife may be with another man, but she will answer the husband's call and say she is in an office. And I bet to me so I bassa or bar water for being so so a shepherd may be a ho. Nancy, so. 
Se ni kuno frenu wa tete fonsua. Ube buwanu waka se. Owa jume bi mu e di jume bi. A husband may be with a young girl in a hotel room. But when his wife calls, he will answer and tell her that he is in a business meeting. Mm -hmm. Hey! Be me bin suso, ebe tumini ababa waki tuwa bi, ako she, aho ho biya demu. Nan su sani, yire fren wa tete fon su nwa fa. Obe kach sani, yire ni se, o ti jume diye nshi e mo bi ase. A man told his wife that he was going to Accra for a business meeting. But his wife saw him with another woman in a restaurant. Hmm. Not knowing that the wife had seen him at the restaurant with a woman. When the wife called the husband and asked him of his whereabouts, the husband said he was in Accra. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Doing his business. Yeah. And the wife said, Is this restaurant we are in in Accra? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm. The wife said, Turn around. I'm right here behind you mm -hmm. in this restaurant in Kumasi. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the husband lied to the wife. Mm -hmm. And the wife caught him. Mm -hmm. Maybe a catch ready, you say, or conquering. Ako di ju mebi, e won shi e mo bi asin. Nen su su e chile yinu. Ne yire hun se, o ni o ba fu froti bebi, ne won mo didi e. Na no on ni mi se, ne yire nsu su wo bebi e, tine didi e no anti. Wa bra ne yire ni fre no, bisa ane se, e hini na wo ano. O ka chile ni yire se, o won kra ya, o ti ju me di e shi e mo bi asin. Mo bi zes. E la ne yire bisa ane se, Baby, I had tea. I ate it. You come as you. I don't say I won't cry. Ah. Oba le kachere le say. Danwani na mi jina haya. Restaurant haya di ingi na jira. O kuru no di a trot le ni gire no. Na ni gire no che no. Yeah. A fake prophet was in the office with a woman, but when his wife called him. He immediately started praying in tongues. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and told his wife that he was mm. praying. Mm. So he will call her later. Hey. All these people claim to be God's people. Yeah. Mm. It's very sad. Very, very sad. Now, deep phobia, no, in your papa. And your baby, a shen office. Now, Bran, you're a friend, no, no. A word was shas, yes, or cacas, afro. And he has had men there, cause I feel for a bit of fear. No, no, we are not. No, catch any here, say, or bomb pie, nature or befriend. Why was Uncle Four wing now? Say, oh, me and Yaman Crawfo. A new papa, 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 papa. If people who claim to be God's people do all this, it is very, very disgraceful mm. because God is not like that. Mm. Se ni pa wa fran wu se wa ye nyan koupon krof wo e ye sa ni me nina. E ye ni mgoa si sem pa. E san se nyame enti sa. The most dangerous lie of all is to lie in the name of the truthful God. A tura e hwa chen ni nina. E ni se wo di asaf wo raditin e be di atro. Mm-hmm. That is saying that God has said something, whereas He has said nothing. Eh? Hmm. That is a very, very serious offense. Very, very. And he said, "O can se nyankupon a can se mbi wa brekronswa on kahe." Aye, and from so kesi pa e humba. Even lying to defend yourself. Doesn't reflect the character of God. Mm. How much more lying in the name of the Lord? Mm. You worsen your case. Impo sa udi atro edi echi chaji wan kasa uhumpo no eno no kwa enye nyangu pon subai na kampese udi asafu radi ding eko diatro. 
and then what seven I say, Kura. That was what Kora and company did. Hmm. Sa and a Kora and then a Krofo. In Numbers chapter 16, Kora confronted Moses and complained that Moses had taken too much upon himself and had exalted himself above the congregation. Hey. So he, Kora, wanted to be the priest of God. Hmm. He spoke as if God had chosen him to lead the people of Israel. But it was a lie. Hmm. Wa numere guma ti dunsi ya. Kora e di besi Moses e nime e kasa kasa e. E bo bu bo se. Moses a jini e ma pi ya boso. Na wa mani honso. E wo ni pe kuo nu e so. E nun ti wa no Kora no. E se se o nun ne beye o sofo a nyamiye ye no. Hey. O nun na na nyamiye ye nu se o me di ni pa nene mo. E nun na e yaktro na na o di. God had not told Korah to take over the priesthood from Moses. Nyankupon ankanchre Korah se, onji osofu penye jumano, enfri Moses in some. And because of lying in the name of the Lord, God became very furious with Korah and caused the ground to split under him and his cohorts. And swallowed him and his household. And all the men who were with him with all their goods. It was serious oh. Very serious. Hey. Mm-hmm. Korah, his household, and all those who were with him went down alive into the pit. And the earth closed over them. Hey. Hey. They all perished instantly. Mm. Hey. Mm. Na esal na tra o di wo nyame din mo ndi no nyame bo fu no pa en o ma asase no bie e wo na se na kora en ni pa ne kan ho nyina no en wo mu efie ni ma nyina e ko she asase no ha hmm ndi kora en ni fie fo en wo mu ne kan ho nyina no e ko she amena no ana asaseno ekata omo so hey serious amuno mu wa omo ina irai na ehun pa o that is how serious it is to lie in the name of the lord but i'm shocked that today's prophets and church people are not afraid to lie in the mm. name of the lord eh sali hu a ehun pa Se udi e uradi tun fo din e be diatro. Yes. Nen so ye mi wan wan pa se e ne ye di fo ni a soriko fo binum en so se udi e uradi din be diatro. I am afraid of what will happen to false prophets of our day. They will regret doing what they are doing. Mi so ma a tre di fo a wo wo ya bre so yi. God was not with Korah and his cohorts because they lied in his name. Nyankupon an ka kora eni ne chidi fuo no ehun. E san se o diatro e won ni dimu. Instantly they lost their spiritual protection. Amurum wa King Saul was also abandoned by God because he was a liar. When the Lord sent him to destroy everything, he lied that he had done what the Lord instructed him to do. And because he was afraid of David, he also lied against David. Wabre nyanku pon suman se, onko se bibiano, o diatro se, di nyame katre ni se, onye nyinano, oye. Na bren su anu, usro David pa asuno, 
ucha atro etu David is. And because of that, King Saul was not protected by God. When the battle got fierce with the Philistines. Na santino, nyankupon a mo o hini so hubayin. Wabra, omone Philistine for un toko anon, emuye deep anon. So if you claim to be a servant of God or a child of God, never lie in his name. And until you now see, say, we are young coupon aqua, and now say, young coupon bar, me near throw in the demon da. Shockingly, there are many prophets and church people who lie in God's name. Mm-hmm. They say all sorts of things God has not said. Mm-hmm. Now, one one seven is a deep four people who are near with dear throw away yami demon. Okay, can't send Pia and Yen Yamin a kaye. In Ezekiel chapter 13, verse 3, God describes them as foolish prophets who follow their own spirits and have seen nothing. What Ezekiel woman, Titu me and son, Chichemu me and son, Yankupon, a da one more de say, Womu ya di fon kwasia foa. Womu di womu ankasa hum echi. Na won hum fe. In Jeremiah chapter 23 verse 21, God said, when he has not even sent some prophets, yet they run. Hmm. And when he has not spoken to them, they spoke as if he had spoken. Wo, odi fo yeremi anguma no ti edionu mi ensa, chichemu edionu ba konso no. Yanku pense, wabra on suma a di fo bino mumpono, ube huwa no mbidi mbidi ka. E na bre su 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 a on kasanche wong su no. O kasati se die, wa kasache wong. And in verse 25 of Jeremiah 23, the Lord said that they are prophets who prophesy in lies in his name. And in verse 31, God again said that he is Against false prophets. Ena wo odi fo yere me yangu manwa ti edionu mi ensan chiche mu edionu nomno e radi kanse wo mu ya di fo wo shen kumtro e woni di mu na chiche mu ediasa ba kunonso no e radi se o time atro e di fo. And for profaning the name of the Lord and defiling the Lord's table. The Lord told the priest in Malachi chapter 1 and 2 that he will send a curse upon them, rebuke their descendants, mm. and spread dung on their faces. Mm. That is serious, oh. Very serious. It will be a big disgrace. Mm. That is why I say that God will disgrace a lot of false prophets. Nase, wo gu asafo eradidinhu fi. Ama abeya hora. Na wasai a go a radi prosu fino. A radi catcher a soft one. Our malaki woman, tibaco, any timi no se. Obasuma no me ako wonso. Na wa ka wa si fono enim. Na hane huno. Wasi wa de mwa e janai ebe sra omanim. Hey! E huo. It is obe gu omani mwasi pa. Runtina me kase. Nan kupon be why is God so furious with false prophets who lie in his name? It is because they make him a liar. I don't know you mean you are a liar. I don't know if you are a liar. I don't know if you are a liar. I don't know if you are a liar. Oh. Hey. But listen to me. God will not, does not, and cannot lie. Therefore, if you profess to be a child of God and you are a liar, you don't have the spirit of God. Mm. You are lying in God's name and you are not a child of God. Mm. Dr. Kukudazi said that. Yeah. 
Nansu tiye me. En tu mi ma. Se nyame. Obe diatro. Ne nyame. On tu mi niatro. Ne nyame. O niatro da. Mm-hmm. Adun tu wuna o siye sa uye nyanku pomba. Ne sa uye o trofwa. O ni nyame hon hon. O diatro e wo nyame di mo. Na wo nye nyanku pomba. Yes. Dr. Kuku does in a kind. Amen. In 2 Kings chapter 5, verse 27, the servant of Elisha, who was Gehazi, became leprous, as white as snow. What was the reason? He lied to Captain Naaman in the name of his mentor, Elisha, mm-hmm. to take things from him and went to hide the things. Mm-hmm. And when he came back in Elisha's presence, and Elisha asked him where he had been, he lied again mm-hmm. that he went nowhere. Hmm. For his lies, Gehazi got a curse. Mm-hmm. Elisha Elisha na ye friend of Gehazi no. Ono su ye kwata emo ye fita fita fita. At the same extreme, a DNT and a man a bassa. O diatro, a tre or straff or penny and your friend Nemano, a war, the penny Elisha demo. And what did you get near my friend Ho and what he could see? No, did near man could see we are obedient Elisha and him. Nay, Elisha beside the set or call hands on O diatro say, one co baby. Now tra o dientino, Gehazi. Mm-hmm. As I said early on, Ananias and his wife Sapphira died instantly mm-hmm. because they lied to the Holy Spirit in Peter's presence. Na sadi makani dada no, Ananias ni ne yiri Sapphira nso so, wo mu wu amuru mu ha. E san se o di atrot re nyame hun kron kron e wo Peter ni. I want professing Christians to see how dangerous and serious it is to lie in the name of the Lord. Me pese mu amu na mu si ese mu ya Christopher wano mu hu a e humpa se ube diatro e wo e radidi mu. In First Timothy chapter four verse two, Apostle Paul said that. Such people are hypocrites who speak lies. O Timothy Muma Dikain, Tinai, Chichemumi, you know, or Smuffle Paul can say, Sankofoni in your chumfoa, or Casa Ewa Tromu. And the conscience of such people are seared with hmm. hot iron. Now, since Sankofon, so, yet the iron. I a shepa at to all my goodness, so I'm an ashi. <laughs> Paul continued to say that there are people who have departed from the faith and have given heed to deceiving spirits and doctrines of demons. Or some of Paul to also can say, Woman, you're not a woman free, did you know? Now, woman, be a woman soon, I'm a homer, a dad, dad, nipper. Hmm. Any a demon in church a burning. Hmm. What Paul said implies that another form of a serious lie is to teach demonic doctrines as if they are from God. The Osuba fu Paul kaya no a pastor say a trust him biwa e hupa and he say ube church a demon in church. Na akamia ti said ye free yamel. Whatever God wants his people to know is already in the Bible. Mm-hmm. Therefore, if anyone teaches another doctrine, you should see that such a person is a liar from the kingdom of demons. A dear biara nyan kupon pese ye hunono. Ning na o Bible mudada. And it is so be a church and church for be a or so who say, Sandy Pano or your trophy or free a damn money. I name any preacher 
who teaches anything that is contrary to scripture is a liar. Yeah. God has not sent them. Such people just want to confuse people to place demons their masters. Nyankupon and Sma Womu. Sanko phone per se near my buffred ni padding. Na omu de shet womu euranum adamoni no energy. The Holy Spirit who inspired the servants to write the word is not in them. Nyame won krunkrua or Kenya nem kwa Emma or Tro Asemono O ni womumu. The Holy Spirit does not mm-hmm. and will not contradict himself. Yeah. Therefore, anyone who teaches anything that is contrary to what the same Holy Spirit has written down in the word of God, he doesn't speak from the Holy Spirit. He speaks from the demonic kingdoms. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. He is deceived by lying demons for him to lie and deceive ignorant people. Hmm. Adam money, Adam said the Bayer or also Subediatro now or the Adada Nipa or Hunia Zimbia. So, if you want to be protected by God and enjoy your life in peace, live in truth, desire to hear the truth always, and deal in truth hmm. in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And on this, I'll present you a coupon about who buy. Now, when need chi or bra ba, who bohu was some jemua. Transi wo no quarimo. Mawanin jise ubeti no quarida. Ne ye o near menina, a wo no quarimo. A wo yes to demo. Amen. Amen. If you want the Lord Jesus Christ to protect you, Give your life to him by praying this prayer with me. So, per se, a radi yesu Christo bow humbaya. Fau humano, wabra one me bosampaye. Lord Jesus, a radi yesu. I thank you for speaking to me today. Me da wase, se wakasa che me ne. I accept that I am a sinner. Me jitum, se me yedibon yeni. But from this day forward, nensu ifri neri kri. I believe in my heart. And confess with my mouth that Jesus, you are the only Lord. Forgive me of all my sins. And write my name in the book of life. Let your Holy Spirit dwell in me. And I will live a holy life to please you. Thank you for saving me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Father, thank you for speaking to your people, for them to see the seriousness of lying in your name, so that they will live in truth to please you. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Odo fwa uti e ye e ye AP Radio 105.7 Kwe siyada anope biyara na onsun kwe si na wachi Na ube ti e discussion suwa e tuwaso se uti e radio nwa E ye yesofu peni Reverend Dr. Kukudazi Efrim En wade nyamia sem ebreo Na uti e nyamia semi ya uti mwuse efri e su kroje a Afra fre biye ni mu. Biya na wuchisha ye chila kwa ina opesa woni ye besuma. Ye wukuma se kase. Ube hun se sa ofa minrudu wa. Ube hun goyo feeling station. 
na go feeling station no e kwai sada ni nchimu isane efa ekofom udru fom ho twan enko ba biya biuma be hu say sign board action power of faith ministries e bo ye iron gate so kwasi adai e ye no nkunu ukwa da biya nyumre no no ni fa e bible adisua ene fia da biya nyumre no no ni fa so e ye mpaibo ene ye papa egusu a woka abambo ho asem no kwari ni se wuni abambo a wasem ye mobbo wo a wuni abambo no asa de wo ho akwa akwa she ahun moni abambo ase o pataku imu wo peni pa chenare na ene se wa wo ba ne chen dia ene ama ne free gift wa na wo do ho akọ kristo ni ma pa sheshe asori a abambo papa wo na fa ho wura ase na wa hwe yi a wo fi frame pa mu na akoto jem na ye papa se ba kon wo ka ya e ye ma re ho kese 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 ne se se bonsam si ne we jai bonsam ye na wo nya bonsam biom ono wo ye atrofo nyina eja wo nya biom a atro e be sadi ni pa ko bonsam jem e san se ye se ye christofo ne su ye di atro pa 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 de wo nya christo ni di atro de ono su si o ye christo ni su di atro especially a fa tete phone so na are who send be a bribe or so for be a waje ne ho e di se wono na wo ye odi for kese e wo gana ha e she ababa we bia me nim no nkom se o mo abua ne ho entoto ayi entuma na ne ma mi be wu na nya me na aka akire no me ka se ababa wa ne wu dada dada ma ne ma me ngusuti ase oh wo mo di nya me di e she nkom tro na asama enwa nwa a etu kora ne na chidi fo no em se o mu enka nyame asem te o mu nim se wo bible mu eno me e beba mo so ene wasefo ene wo mo mo ka ho nyina asa de emu aja na e be sra mo nim e ya asem ye serious pa enti onwa do fo se wo te asori mu na wa ye wo ho te se ukuta be ye na de shada shisha shen ko mo asori ho se wi odi fo ahwe ye Nyame nka hwe wusi nyame na aka ene de enye na kra especially abeifo na omo wo wo nsori mu omo so omo ye ayenkom hyefo enso ye beyi na omo de hye nkom na omo si nyame na eka hwe ye na nyame abu fushi wa ma wo so ene wasefo nyina enya aso da nyame hira wo pa amen amen mama onua se wa nya nyame akoa anyame wo mtirim any a sorry, ye can no quarry go more. A throne who might do one and cut that. My dear, if you don't follow God's true servant to be in God's genuine church mm-hmm. with the Holy Spirit in, the lying spirit in you will never go away. It's true. You have to be trained properly to have the nature of the Holy Spirit. So that he can protect you in all your ways. Mm-hmm. If you seriously want to be in heaven, come to church and let us train you. God has power to deliver you from every demonic situation. Mm-hmm. I know why I say that. Yes. That is why I and my spiritual children, we always say that with God, all, all things, things are, are possible. possible. God bless. Yes. Only at the sunny, we are home.